training camp is days away, and Cowboys lineman Isaac Alarcone faces an uphill climb. It's, it's starting from scratch. A native of Monterey, Mexico, Isaac joined the Cowboys in 2020 thanks to the NFL's International Player Pathway Program, an effort to grow the game globally by providing opportunities for non-U.S. citizens. I can't tell you how much love that we have for Isaac. Since coming to America's team, Isaac has spent all three years on the practice squad, appearing in just a few preseason games. The Pathway Program is temporary, though, and Isaac is no longer eligible so when last season ended he was sweating over his future so i was getting ready for, to just like go back to mexico man finish my college degree and everything until he got a call from will mcclay cowboys vp of player personnel and he was like man isaac we don't want to let you go we want to sign you back just one condition and he was like by the way we want you to play defense now isaac would have to switch positions from offensive line to defensive line. I've never played this position before. You don't see that transition a lot in the NFL. A challenge he's taking head on. Need a heel and you might get a quick set. Boom. So for the last five months? Yep, yeah, exactly. Exactly. The 24 year old has put in work with local D line trainer Brandon Tucker. <laughs> You know, I'm fortunate enough to work with a multiple of cowboy guys. So, you know, we were doing our normal workout and I was like, damn, that's. <laughs> That's Big Isaac, what's he doing here? Oh, Tuck, they flipped him. <laughs> he needs some work, let's go. He, looked, he looks good, he looks, he looks good inside. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm excited to see him in padded work. I, I'm not trying to like learn everything in a chunk, just like, okay, step by step, you know? You know, it almost seems a little more natural for him. I'm excited for Isaac. You know, he's put the work in and he's, he's built a, an outstanding foundation. Not only is Isaac making the transition from offensive line to defensive line, He's trying to make history in the process. Striving to become the first NFL player born and raised in Mexico to make a 53-man roster. And for me, being from a different country and being able to still be here, you know, it just humbles me and makes me thankful. It's no secret the Mexican community makes up a substantial segment of the Cowboys fan base. As to how we look to the future of Vaqueros de Dallas and our Mexican fans, they're our point of emphasis. And part of that emphasis is representation. There's no doubt Isaac Alarcón is a source of pride for football fans in Mexico. Keep chasing your dreams, you know, pray about it. Don't be afraid of trying something new, you know, you never know what is going to happen. In Plano, I'm Jonah Javad.